Hey everyone, it's Coach Rebecca from First Seed Greater Philadelphia again, back for our fitness today. So we have obviously changed our time to be at one o'clock. So we asked you guys kind of what works for you. So hopefully this continues to work for you. And you know, if you're here with us, great. If you're watching it at a later time, that's awesome too. So whatever works for you guys, just let us know. And um, we look forward to working out with you guys every day, getting, you know, being active or being um, in any way that, you know, that works for you guys. Um, and it's a beautiful day today, so I'm definitely going to go for a walk today. So, you know, if you guys can get outside to do a little bit of, you know, get some fresh air, that's awesome. <clears throat> Let me see here. He's going to be doing our live Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Um, yesterday he was outside, so that was awesome to see. For today, hey, Coach Lewis, how are you? How are you guys? What's good. going on? It's good to, it's good to see you. Good so to see you today, also. So for today, our classes are, you know, posted at 3 o'clock. So for today, what we suggest is that you do this workout before the class. So like I mentioned before, <clears> we did a survey. We asked you guys kind of what works for you. And one thing was is that you said, you know, a time in the afternoon would work better and that you wanted some more cardio. So today we're going to be doing some cardio. Are you ready for that, Coach Lewis? I'm ready to get my heartbeat pumping. Let's do it. Your heartbeat pumping. All right. That's the way to do it. So I'm going to probably move my um, stand, you know, a little bit throughout the workout so you can kind of see sure. everything. Let me just see if I move it down a little bit more, if that's better. All right. So first we're going to just get some, we're just going to get moving a little bit here, do some stretches. All right. We're going to warm up. So I'm just going to, I'm just moving my heel to my glute, you know, doing a little kick here. All right. And we're going to move from side to side like this, twisting your body. Yep. All right. For the old people, be careful. Spider yeah, only, only, do, only do what feels good. Feels right. All right. We're going to stand right like this. All right. We'll push to one side. Other side, I felt a crack there. So push your body out. Make sure you're turning your hips and your shoulders. All right. If you want to squat down a little bit and reach back up, get your body moving a little bit more. All right. All right. What we're going to do next is we're going to go down into a downward dog. So Coach Lewis, again, I know you were on yesterday for our live fitness, and then you were on again for yoga. So we want to get right. some stretching in. So if you got any pointers on this, sure. let us know, because you seem like you're, you're an expert on a lot of things. So <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to go into a downward dog. So I don't know. Can you see, Coach Lewis? Or you yes, can do I it can. from your side. So yep. you can show them. So you're going to go into a downward dog. And then you're going to put your toes back, and you're going to go to a pike. And then go back down. We'll do it three times. So one, <clears throat> up, go back down, two, up, and three. Whatever feels good for you, make sure that when you're reaching up right now, when you're in that down, downward dog position, that your chin is up in the air so you get a nice good stretch. Come back up onto your toes. You'll be in a squat position, so I'll go forward again. Can you see, Coach Lewis? You're going to go in a squat position, and you're just yep. going to swing from side to side. One of my goals is that I want to be able to, to put all my, my pressure and weight on, the, on my front, on my fo forearms here. Uh, you probably can do it, Coach Lewis. I'm not understanding what you're doing. So do you, like, lean all the way forward? And you come off the ground. Oh yeah. oh, yeah. Something. Yeah, I got to get some balance. I'm trying to do a handstand. You'll get there. You'll get there. Stand. Yeah. All right, so come on up. And we'll get ready to go here. All right. Do you have water with you today? I do. Good. Oh, he's got some water. Handy. All right, so what we'll get... We're going to do... So what I'll do is I'll explain the workout. We're going to do... We're going to do three rounds of everything at 30 seconds each with a 20 second or 50, I'm sorry, 15 second rest in between. So our first okay. move is going to be, again, let me see if I can, all right. If you can't see or you need me to explain it again, let me know. But you're going to okay. do, I'll go to the side here so you can see. You're going to do four low kicks, one, two, three, four. You're going to come down, put your hands on the ground and go up to a donkey kick. Could you nice. see that? I did, yes. Okay, perfect. So we'll do that. 
30 seconds, 15 second rest, and we'll move right in to our next workout. Okay. <clears throat> so we'll get started right now. Let's go. We got 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. All right, 15 second rest. We'll do that two more times. Okay. This one, everybody, to, this one, everybody to know. Just get your heart rate pumping. Slow motion better than no. Uh, slow motion is better than no motion, but we want to get that heart rate going. And if you can only do, if you can't jump up with both legs, you can do kick, one side, one, two, three, four. Come up with one leg. Come up with the other leg. We got five seconds left. Two, one, rest. Nice. Good job. Good job, coach. Yeah, you too. All right. We're going back down. In two, one, let's go. We got 10 seconds left. Try and make sure you're staying as low as you can when you're doing those four punches, like you're in a squat. Two, one, rest. All right, our next move, we got 10 second rest. Our next move is gonna be a squat, squat jump to a side punch. All right, so you're gonna go down, jump up, punch. Down, jump up, punch. Okay. All right, you ready to go? Let's go. Yes, ma'am. Make sure you're turning your shoulders and your hips in the movement. It's a mini jump. You're not working on how high you can jump. It's just to get your heart rate up and rest. All right, who do we got here? Let's see. Rock the dream. She's All a, right, Dakota. She's in Thanks a for joining us. All right, let's go back down. I can dream has been on here consecutively for a while. Every day. We're happy to have you join us live. Waylon, hopefully, is doing it. All right, three, two, one. And like I said, it's not about doing high jumps. It's just about controlling everything. So you're going down. You're controlling, right? You're going down and you're controlling. All right, you ready? Yes, ma'am. Let's go. All right, we got five, four, three, two, one. Whew. All right. Now we probably have one of my least favorite things to do okay. when you're doing cardio, which is it's a combination of plank jump, plank jump, I can't even say it, okay. plank jacks and mountain climbers. So Ooh. you're going to be down. Right, you're gonna do one, two, and then you're gonna one, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Nice. So for everybody who doesn't know what a 
a plank jack is. It's like a jumping jack with your feet, okay? So if you couldn't see Coach Rebecca, you're looking at me from behind. I'm in a plank. I'm doing one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay? Yeah. Try so to bring your knees of, forward. Right? Try to get your feet as wide as you can. If you're slipping like I am, get some flip-flops or some shoes. Two, Hopefully they're clean. One. So you're bringing your knees forward. And you're doing it fast. Two, three, four, six. Two jacks. One, two, three, four, six. Six mountain climbers. One, two, four, five, six. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, two, one, rest. I'm going to go get my water because that was a doozy, that one. Ooh. Fixing my. All right. When you're ready, come right back in, Coach Lewis. You want to make sure that you're not sticking your back up in the air like this and doing this, but you're doing this. One, two, four, five, six, one, two, one, two four, five, six, one, three, two, one. All right. How we you feel, Coach Lewis? Eisman Golf Academy joining us. Hey, how you guys doing? Shane Kelly. All right, three. What's going on? Two, okay. one. You keep talking to the people. All I'll right. I'll show them what we're working on. <laughs> one, two, three, you should feel this in your abs, people. Get some One. cardio in. Five seconds left. One. Nice. Rest. Whew. Way to go. Not only are we trying to get you guys in the best shape possible, okay? Mind, body, and spirit, but also getting that heart rate pumping, okay? Which that's what all what cardio means. Heart rate, get it up, okay? All right. Not so calling it easy, move. it's called a challenge. All right, here's the next move. Our next move is going to be a, a side shuffle with a jump to one side. Side shuffle, jump. Try and land softly for me so the people below my apartment don't hear me. But for everybody else, it's good for your knees. And again, it's all about that control, okay? So we'll get started in three, two, one. So you're shuffling, going up, shuffle, go up. Shuffle, go up, shuffle. Stay low to the ground if you can. It's kind of like a moving basketball. Staying low, trying to get the ball or protect your player. Two, one, rest. Coach Lewis, did you play basketball? I did. Oh, yeah? I did. Okay. Not for long. Okay. But I did. I was deep. Yeah, my, my, height, my height stopped me. All right, let's go. What other sports did you play growing up? I played, I played basketball, soccer, and baseball. And golf was your favorite? Golf was... Just something that I was just good at. I would like to think of myself as an athlete. So you were naturally good at it or you still had to work at it? I feel like I was naturally good at every sport, but All right. golf is and something rest. I enjoy. Okay, nice. Nice. See, the added bonus of doing this with some of your friends or your coworkers is that the more you talk, the more your heart rate goes up, it's more of a workout. So you got that. Ready right. to go? Let's go. I'm ready. Here we go, coach. Also, think about this move that you don't want somebody to get by you. So you got your hands out 
like this, staying low, okay? Don't let somebody get by you. We got eight seconds left. Two, one, rest. Nice. Clap it up for yourself. Give yourself a round of applause. We got one more round of this, right? Absolutely. Don't Just forget. telling people Three rounds they need to encourage. That's for right. Sure. Absolutely. All right, let's go. Here we go. And if you can't do a skip, you can always walk like this and jump. Or you can walk and you Absolutely. can go up on your toes. Or get some high There's knees always, in there. Always a way to modify it. Get some high knees. High knees if you can't jump, you know. High knees. Get your knees high, okay? Like you're walking up over a big step. Uh, Three. High knees. Two. High knees. One. High knees. Rest. All right. So, Coach Lewis, our next move, we're going to be our feet. We're going to be hip width apart. We're going to come up, tap our heel. All right. Okay. If you can go fast, you can jump. If you just want to step, you can step. So join okay. me whenever you get it. So two, right? One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, two, one, two. So you're getting the inside inside of your thigh here, where you should feel it moving, right? Obviously you feel it on the leg that's on the ground, right? Keeping you steady and rest. If you need some water, go get some water. Don't be afraid. Yeah, get I'm going to drink some water, water right now. Hop back in with us. Okay? All right. Slow motion better than no motion. All right, let's go. Remember, to modify, guys, okay? Just come up. Try to step. Keep your balance. Okay? And if you can't do that, I just want you to march in place. I want you to move, okay? So if you can't do slow and step like this, march in place. All right, here we go. All right, and rest. Sorry, I wasn't <clears> on <throat> the time. But the one thing to remember is that you guys, everything that you do, everything you're doing schoolwork wise, practicing your golf game, you know, any of that stuff, get ready to go. And two, one, any of that stuff that you're going to do. The only person you're doing it for is you, all right? So in yoga yesterday, they talked about things that you can control. You can show up. I mean, you can control what you do for yourself, right? It's really all we Effort can do. Effort and right attitude. Now. Effort and attitude. Those are the two things you control. How much effort you put in something and your attitude, how you feel about something. And one thing, you know, I learn a lot from all of our coaches all the time and rest. A lot of our coaches, and Coach Lewis included in this, it's all about what you put in, what you get out. If you got a, po a positive attitude, a smile on your face, that's your right. inside will know that. Your mind will that's know right. that, and that's what matters. All right, we're going right. to take a little bit of a longer break here so you can get some water. We can cool Good. down a little bit before we get our heart rate back moving again. What we're going to do is we're going to do a jumping jack to a side. So jumping jack, side. Jumping jack, side. So I'm just gonna put this down on the ground real quick, just so you can see it, Coach Lewis. What you're gonna do is you're gonna do a regular jumping jack. Oh, I'm sorry, you're gonna go do a regular jumping jack, and then you're just gonna go out with one foot, okay? Uh, so you go okay. down with your hands like that, and then you go back to the middle, regular jumping jack, out with one foot. So just one jumping jack or two? One jumping jack, okay. and then a side, okay. all right? So one jumping jack in the middle, one side. So okay. whenever you're ready, whenever you get it, okay. you can go. So you're basically putting that leg out front to push off of it and come back. And if you can notice, me and Coach Rebecca are sweating. <laughs> Not so much effort we're putting into this. Okay? All right, and rest. So you don't need to you don't need to sweat, but I want you to push yourself as hard as you can go without sustaining an injury, okay? 
And the important thing is make sure you're drinking that water if you are going to sweat. That's right. All right, let it go. Remember, CDC hydration, half your body weight in ounces of water may seem like a lot, but that's how much you need to be fully hydrated. And remember, when you're staying inside, okay, you may feel like you're not high dehydrated, but you are. Okay? So get that replenishment of water. Two, one. Sorry. I missed the timer again. We're on you, you coach. Know, 30 seconds doesn't feel like a long time. And it's really not if you think about it. It goes by pretty quickly. What goes by even faster is our rest. So already we're going back into it. I just want to make sure that we thank everyone who's been watching the channel, who's been watching our lives. Yes. You know, we appreciate you. We appreciate everything that you're doing at home. You know, keeping your kids entertained if you have kids, keeping your dogs and your pets entertained if you got them. Keeping everybody. And most of all, respecting yourself for doing this workout with us. And rest. Amen. One of our code of conduct here, the first thing is respect yourself before anybody else. And Absolutely. if you're doing a workout with us, you're respecting yourself and your body. So kudos to you. Amen. All right. So what we're going to do next is I'm just going to go to the side here so you can see. I'm going to do one, two, crisscross. So I'm going to come across my body, across my body, okay. and I'm going to kick up. All right. I'm going to do again. One, two, kick up. One, two, kick up. So you're getting your leg up in the air and then you're kicking. All right. Okay. Do we want to try to be as low as possible or how are we supposed to do that, coach? Yeah, that's a good idea. So you want to be low to the ground, like you're almost in a squat. Like, not, not necessarily, but you're getting ready to go into a squat. Mini squat. So you're going to be low. All right, and kick up. If you can step right. it up, you can put a jump in there, but you don't have to. All right, when you're ready to go, let's get ready, and we're going to go. One, two, kick. One, two. One, two. You should feel this Again. in your quad. Your quad muscle, because that's the muscle we're working on here. So you will be leaning forward, all right? You're probably tighten your core a little bit as you lean forward, all right, to kick that back leg up, all right? Make sure you keep your balance in three, two, one. Good job. Yeah. These, these types of workouts get your heart rate to slow down a little bit. All right, you catch your breath a little bit more, and then you get right back into it. Our next move, we're going to get ready to go. Oh. Go ahead. Sorry. One, two. All right, and rest. How are you feeling, Coach Lewis? Great, great. I'm going to take a swig of water real quick before we get into our next one. we got five seconds. we got this one more time, right? Yes, ma'am. All right, let's get ready to go. It's almost like you're in a single squat when you're doing that kickback. Your front knee... It's bent. All right, and rest. All right, so our next move, we're gonna go, we're gonna keep with the kicks. We're gonna stay on our right leg first. Our right okay. leg is gonna be still. We're gonna go front kick, side kick, front kick, side kick. If you can step it up, you're gonna jump when you do your kicks, but you don't have to, okay? You can just keep that leg, that leg still, and you can, if you, if you need to, kick, put your leg down, kick to the side. If you can, kick, and just go right to the side. Kick, front, Now, are, are kick, we only side. doing one side at a time? At a time, yes. So we're gonna okay. keep our right leg 
our right leg down. All right. Okay. All right. When you're when you're ready, we'll wait a couple more seconds so All I can right. drink some water. Let me see who's on here. John F. Byrne, Benjamin Davies, what's going on? Gavin. Flo, oh, speaking of which, fight we got night. five seconds left. But you ready? Let's go. We got Ben Davies is our superintendent at Walnut Lane. And right now he's taken over our Instagram. Obviously not for right now. But he's posting everything he's doing today in regard to the golf course. As a reminder, the golf course is closed. It is not open. Oh, man, that means we can't go outside and hit golf balls? No. Nope. Three, two, one. Woo. That right I leg felt is that feeling one, it. I felt, oh, yeah. felt that one. Shake your leg out. The leg that's moving feels it, and the leg that's steady is moving it. All right, now we're going to lay. We're going to rest on our left side. We're going to go in three, two, one. Kick side. And when you kick to the side, move your body to the side. So you can get that full range. If I sit in here, I might fall over. Move to the side a little bit. Remember to breathe, people. You're moving your body. Getting cardio in. 10 seconds left. If you need to take Three, a pause, take a pause. Two. Get one. back into it. Ooh. Shake your legs out. Shake your legs out. All right. This last round, we'll do front side, and then you'll do switch. Front side. Hey, so Heather, right, you got it. You got it, Heather. Stick right in left. there. Remember, what you put out, you're going to put in. Okay? Hang tough, Heather. You All got right, let's it. let's go. And Heather, if you can't move, okay, I just want you to knee up, turn, kick to the side. You don't need a bounce like us. You kick to the side, okay, Heather? Come on, I'm going to do it with you. Come on. Here we go. Moving slow. Get that knee as high as I can. Okay, moving slow. Get that knee as high as I can. Okay, moving slow. Get as high as I can. There you go, Heather. I see you, Heather. There you go, right. Heather. And rest. Heather, <clears throat> hand clap to you. You got it. You push through. Even though I can't see you, I feel you. All right, we're moving to the other side. I'm going to do the hop. If you can't do the hop, go ahead and go nice and slow. All right? All right. All right. You do the bounce, Heather. Do the bounce. Come on, bounce with me. All right. We're, we're moving on to our next move, but do you want to do this one more time? Okay. I thought we had to do the other side first. We had body mass, Remember that, what we talked about that yesterday. Third, that third time, you were supposed to switch on and off, but did you only do one side? Because then we were uh, doing it again. I only did one side, yeah. All right. Let's okay. do it again. No big deal. Okay. Let's get ready to go. Right. In three, two, one. I don't want your body to be out of whack there. Yeah, body math, what we talked about yesterday. But we'll do one side, we gotta do the other. I apologize. Come no big deal. I missed, no, you're I good. missed that part. Sometimes I, sometimes I talk too fast. You know, just trying to make sure that Instagram doesn't cut us off because we went too long. Just want to keep us moving. But you're good. That's why it's good to have two people doing this. One people can focus on the crowd. You know? Coach Lewis is the first one to do that. All right. We got to join us. Mags 7 up. What's up, Mags? How you doing? Uh, we're all right. We're being strong, Mags. That's right. We're all being Trying strong. Trying to get guns. Together. All right. So all right what's our next move, we're, Coach? We're going to touch down. We're going to go down and push forward. So it's almost like, it's almost like, you know, I'm no football ex expert, but if I were to get a football from someone, I'd grab it. I know I don't talk it like that, but or how, in my mind. How about a chest pass in basketball? Let's yeah, there you go. The so there you go. But do you go down like that in basketball? Well, let's just say it's a squat and a chest pass. Yeah, so you want to make sure down. that you're going, you're going down, okay? So you don't, want to sit, you don't want to go down like this and your legs are locked. You want to go down, touch the ground, come up, and chest pass. So All we're right? squatting and chest passing. All right, yep, here squatting we go. Squatting and chest passing. Three, two, one, let's go. And you can do a jump. If you feel comfortable, I'm going to jump at the top. So I'm not going to do two jumps. Do what feels comfortable for you. Just make sure you're squatting.
Get that heart rate up, people. Push yourself. Okay, we're going to come out of this quarantine much better than when we started. All right, and rest. Nice. Nice. Dunny88, what's going on? Hopefully Mags you're joining and, with us. Mags and Dunny, you guys doing this with us? Put a comment down below so we know. Three, two, one, let's go. Okay. Modify, guys, okay? Go down, touch the ground, come up, arms forward, okay? If you can't touch the ground, like I said again, I just want you to move, okay? So maybe a little jog in place, put a little bounce. Everybody should be able to do that. A little jog, okay? The idea is to get your heart rate pumping. We need that heart rate. Three, two, one. Nice. Whew. Wipe the sweat off your brow if you need to. I do. I need some. Okay. Grab some water. I got a gallon here. Danny right, Poland. Three, What's two, going one. on, Danny? Let's go. When you're ready and you've gotten your water. I think I said this the other day, but one really cool thing is that everyone who checks in to see if our coaches, the first T is doing their fitness, is keeping us accountable. Make That's sure right. we're doing it. Two, That's one, right. rest. All right. So next move, I'll give us a little bit of a rest here. Our next move is going to be, we're going to be running in place. Again, what running a place is good for you, what works for your body, okay? If you need to do low impact, again, like Coach Lewis is saying, just do your little marches, but get your feet moving. What we're going to be right. doing is running in place. We're going to be putting our arms up and out, arms up and out. So when you're marching, I want you to still move your arms up and That's out, right. up and out, just like that, okay? Whatever you're good with, whatever, don't take the easy way out but just do what you gotta do, all right? All right, let's get ready to go. Wipe off some sweat. <coughs> Five, what, was that a sneeze? Bless you. Three, Thank you. Two, one, we're running in place. We're gonna put our, once you get that running ready, you're gonna go up and out. Again. And try to be rhythmical just, here. Right, control it, right? Don't just go like this, right? Go up and out, up and out, if you can. For the last 15, speed your running up. All right, get those knees a little bit higher if you can. Three, two, one, rest. Nice. Whew. Very nice. Who else we got on here? J-Roll. We got Great shirt, Lewis. two more exercises left. Two more. Two more. Two and by, more. The time, by the time others see this later, it will be right in the nick of time for your class to get started. All right, nice. we're going up, up and out whenever you're ready. Make sure you breathe, people, breathe. Come on, have got, breathe with me. We got a nice little video from one of our older students doing the class today. She's got some petting drills. Oh, that's great. Can't wait for those. I hope you all submit some questions to her. It's Riley. Three, two, one. And rest. And just to let everybody know, Riley is a great putter. Woo! She can put the lights yeah. out of it, let me tell you. All right. Five, four, three, two, and we're going to get ready to go. Get your running ready. All right, now go up and out. Coach Lewis, I thought you were bringing the, the tunes today. The tunes, I'll bring it next time. All right. For sure. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice. All right. Our next move, we're going to give ourselves. Ian Bella, what's going on? Uh, first to alumnus, I believe. Hopefully that's the right Ian. Great guy. Thanks for tuning in, Ian. Good to see you. Our next move. 
It is great to see him. Hopefully he does tune in because love to hear how he's doing. Keep Absolutely. staying positive. Get moving. All right, our next move is going to be we're going to do toe, toe touches out. All right? So you're going to, again, if you can, skip. All right? Coach Lewis, you probably explained this a little better, but what you're doing is you're bringing your leg up and you're going to kick it out and touch. Yeah, All I right, reach at the same time. Almost like the right. can, the can can people from Acme. Can can. Yeah, they, do, 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 do. And if you can't do that reach, like Coach Lewis is doing, just kick your oh, just kick your leg out. <laughs> Be careful there, Coach. We yeah. need you, Coach. We need you. Get a glue to put this all, right. all together. Oh, hey, Coach, no. are we all doing right, two, go. two kicks of yep. two kicks aside? Two kicks. Yep, two kicks on each okay. side. Okay. All right. Here we go. You lost me for a sec. My uh, my phone is going it's all right. I got it. I got it. Let's keep going. Come on, Ian. All right, yeah. Let's... Three, two, one. There used to be a commercial on Acme. The supermarket local here in Philly, tri-state area, with the can-can girls. That's what I remember. Hopefully, I'm not telling my age, but that was a great commercial. That's what I remember from those kicks. Yeah, and when they had sales on the cans, right? Yeah, absolutely. All right, let's get ready to go again. I just plugged my phone in. Hopefully, we got some more time. I remember. To modify, okay? Get your knee up at least. Try to go over to the side, okay? And if you can, another balancing technique is that you could kick and kick, gather yourself, kick and kick, okay? So you either got the knee to knee, okay? Or you got the kick to kick. Nice. And rest. Okay. We got one more time of that, Coach Lewis? I believe so. I was lost count. I think this will be the third time, absolutely. All right. Get ready to go in three, two, one. All right. Woo! Can, 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 you yeah. took a dance class in college? Oh, yeah. For us athletes, it was a good day. Nice. Easy day. Two, one, rest. Nice. All right. Ooh. Our very My last heart. workout, which means Get some water. we are so Get close to the end here. I'm gonna get some water in one sec. What I'm gonna do, all right, put this down right here. All right, hopefully you can see me. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get in a plank position, all right? We're gonna go plank, plank position. we're gonna go shoulder tap, shoulder tap, pike. Come back down, get your core tight, get your legs tight, get everything tight and tap and tap. Come up, tap, all right. tap. All right, let me move right. my timer closer to me. All right. Got to love a good core. That's the stability. What we're going to do, we're going to take this one a little bit longer. We're going to go 45 seconds. 45. <clears throat> All right. All right. So when you're ready, get up off those knees and we're going to get started in two, one. Let's oh. go. I get my flip flops on so I'm not one, slipping. Two. Up. One, two. Now, don't just go up from your pike and go right into those shoulder taps. I want you to go up from your pike, come into a plank, tighten everything up, and then shoulder tap. All right? If you need to, go to your knees for your shoulder tap, come back up to a pike, and go up, and then put your knees back down and do your shoulder tap. Okay? Get everything tight. Shoulder tap, shoulder tap. Up, come back down, shoulder tap, shoulder tap. 
You want your arms or your hands right underneath your shoulders. That's right. Whew. Come back up. We need up. to take a break. Come back down. We're breaking in three, two, one, and rest. Remember, if you need to take a break like I just did, take a break, gather yourself, get right back into it. All right, we're going back in for right. another 45 in five, four, three, two, one. All right, let's go. Pike. Two. Pike. One, two. Pike. One, two. You got 20 seconds left. I know you can do it. Go up, tighten up. One, two, 10 seconds left. One, two, pike up. One, two, three, two, one, rest. All right, our last round. All right, we're gonna change it up just a little bit. Okay. We're gonna go into a pike. We're gonna tap our shoulders. We're going to jump up and jump. All right. So we're going to shoulder tap, right. jump with our legs up, and then come up. So shoulder tap, shoulder tap, jump up, jump up. All right. You ready? Let's go. All right. Jump back, shoulder tap, shoulder tap, jump up, jump up, jump back, shoulder tap, shoulder tap, jump up, jump back, jump back, shoulder tap, shoulder tap, up. And again. If you need to modify, step, back, shoulder tap, shoulder tap, step up, go on your toes, all right? But if you can, jump, jump, jump back, one, two, jump, jump, jump. Oh. We got 10 seconds Look. left, six, five, four, Three, two, one, jump, jump. Uh, nice, coach. That one beat me up. That was good. All right. All right. So take a deep breath. If you need to, grab your water. Bring it to the ground with you. What we're going to do is you're just going to stretch with our feet right out in front of us, just like this. So you can do a nice stretch. All right. Start controlling your breath a little bit. In your One nose. of the yoga moves we learned yesterday, guys. In your nose, out through your mouth. <laughs> Heather, I swear I'm not trying to hurt you. <laughs> All right. What do you want to do? We want to make you better, Heather. Take your left arm, put it across your body, hold your hold your thigh with it. If you can, take your right arm even further back. I don't know if you can see. Further back and try and twist your body. Whew. All right. If you can, bring your left arm even back even further. Stretch it out. What you're going to do is you're going to do that to the other side. Take body your opposite mat. arm. Opposite we learned arm. that yesterday. Body Switch mat. it to the other side. Sometimes, because I'm on a hardwood floor, I can kind of use it as a gripper for me. Keep my hand down. Stretch my body even more. Carpet's pretty slippery. Yeah. All right. What I like to do... Take your, first, your one of your legs right in front of you. I'm going to take my left leg first, put my right leg back down. I know we did this the other day with Coach Lewis. I don't know if he did this yesterday too, but we're going to take our body and we're going to come all the way down. We're going to lean all the way forward. Ooh. Again, right now, this stretching time is really important for your body to slow slow your heart rate down, catch your breath a little bit. Your, your sweat is still dripping, and that's okay. Let it fall. As my girl, Sydney Cummings, says, who's, a, who's an online trainer, she says, you earned it. You earned that sweat. Don't be afraid of it. Put your body yeah, on Yeah, Heather, you down. earned it. All right. You know, it's always crazy when you do workouts like this, and you're going to just switch to the other side. When you do workouts like this, it's incredible what your body is capable of doing. And, you know, your, right. your mind is what pushes your body to do these things outside of your comfort zone. So it's okay. You know, you're, no, you're not going to be able to – Always do everything the first time around, but man, I couldn't even do crunches probably two years ago the way I can do crunches now. So it's crazy 
what your body can do and your mind is what pushes it. So make sure you fill that mind up with good stuff, good positive, positive motivational things that you fill your mind up with. All right, we're gonna come right into the middle here. We'll do a little frog sit. All right, stretch down so you can see. Come down, down to the side as much as you can. All right, again, you're gonna feel it in your inner thighs. All right, if you can and if you need to, try and push your knees down a little bit. So lean on them a little bit, come on down. Kind of similar to our stretch that we did in the beginning where we were in that squat position. All right, come on down even closer. Try and bring your body closer to it. All right, Coach Lewis, you got anything for us? Nope. Tune in tomorrow, same time. You'll be with me. Hopefully, nice outside. I'll be outside. If not, I'll be indoors. But stay tuned. We're going to keep working hard so we can get 1% better each day. Yep. And don't forget to tune into our, our takeover today. We got a takeover on our first T page and a takeover on John F. Burns pages. So check out what the superintendents yeah. are doing. They're working real hard to make sure that the golf course is in great shape for you guys. So I'm going to go dry off all my sweat and drink a bunch of water. So I there hope you guys go. have a great Tuesday and we'll see you tomorrow. Hey, Coach. Thanks a lot. See you guys. Thanks, Coach Lewis.